eating locally, eating fresh, and this very tall chef, Chef Paul Boomer. <laughs> Is that good? Close. Bomer. Most people say Bomer. Bomer is say here Bomer. with Gray County Chef Far Farm, rather, is where all of this beautiful um, produce, veggies, and products are from, cheeses, meats. And the cool thing is, you're so smart. On Saturdays, typically restaurants are closed. The chefs yes. are preparing, you know, all the different things for the night. Yeah. And you decided while the chefs are in the kitchen doing that, you would open up the front of house, the dining area, and allow in all the, these local vendors so people could come to your restaurant at Queen and Ossington. Yes. From 10 to 2 yeah. on Saturdays. Every Saturday. And they the can summer. pick up stuff like this. So you have, look at this, colorful radishes. Because you eat with your eyes. Radishes, peas, broccoli, cauliflower. I eat these raw, like not the skin, but yeah, I just yeah. shell them and then pop them and in a great pop, snack. They're delicious. Great for kids. Absolutely. Broccoli, cheese. Talk to us about these products. Uh, some maple syrup, uh, local barbecue sauce. We have some fresh scapes. Which are what delicious. What do you do with scapes? Uh, you just blanch them lightly and saute them in butter and use them as a vegetable on the plate. But they're garlic scapes, so yes, they, have they have that have a nice garlic flavor, in. yeah. And you use the whole thing? The whole thing. Okay, so you chop you can it use up. It with fish, you can put it on any kind of meat you like. And it's they really look good. so pretty, too, right? Yeah. Okay, so you're going to actually prepare a dish right now that you offer in the restaurant, which changes all the time based yes. on the local ingredients. Whatever comes in on the weekend, we try to use as much as possible from the farmers. So it's good very for farm you. to table. Even your fish. Even it's the fish all, is local, all local, sustainable. sustainable. Yes, high fives to you, chef. Ow, try. he's true. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. It's okay. It's fine. See what's happening here, chef. Okay, so we are going to begin with beautiful local lettuce. So we have some local lettuces. We have some lamb loin from that's local as well that has been seared off. And we're just going to do a, a nice little uh, salad. Nice. Summer salad. So a fresh nice and meal. fresh meal. And, you know, just with a little bit of vinaigrettes. We made with some honey, some Dijon. Uh, some fresh thyme from the farm as well, and the carrots and the radishes. So it's just a nice. What's this here? Uh, feta? This cheese? is this is the sheep's milk feta. Sheep's milk feta. Yes. And how the heck do you cut these shallots without tearing? I tear up every time. I put it in the fridge first. That's the trick. That's for how long? Just leave, do it overnight. First. Overnight. Okay. Good. We don't so, want any tears, right? No. So let's begin. We're going right. to whip this up, and by we I mean you. I'm going to do it. Yes. <laughs> so this is amazing. So you only do this open market in your kitchen, uh, your dining room rather, on Saturdays. Right. And do you find it's very busy? Uh, yes, it's starting to get there. It's Words really getting good. out. Words getting out, and that's the whole idea of today. Is it just for the summer, or do you do it all? Just year for long? the summer. Okay. So we're going to add all these ingredients in here. Yep. And it's all about and the fresh ingredients. Everything tastes so much better, and you don't need all the preservatives no. No. and the mayonnaise and all those sauces that are laden with butter because it all is so vibrant. Oh, what was that, Chef? That's olive oil and some. Uh, Vinegar, some locally made vinegar as well. Apple cider? No, this is a Chardonnay. Chardonnay? Vinegar. Yes, from Niagara. Okay. Yes, from Niagara. Okay. Let me just add some salt and pepper. And how did you cook the lamb? Was it a pan fry? Was it a barbecue? I pan fried it. So how long each side? Uh, but this one I cooked for about a minute on each side. It's pretty rare, but I like it rare. Okay, you recommend that? Yes. But you could have it a little bit more medium well, yes? You can have it any way you want. Okay. So everybody, everybody knows that. Do you have uh, vegetarian dishes as well? Um, on, made on request, yes. On request, okay. But we are looking at starting a whole new um, style of, of vegetarian cuisine with all the local vegetables. Yeah, very good. So yeah, it's going to be pretty exciting. Quinoa and things like that. Yep. Okay, so we've ha we have the dressing. Yes. Dressing meat the salad, salad meat the dressing. <laughs> so we'll put the salad right oh, okay. inside here. Oops. Which I've yeah, already some. mixed up Brad together. Brad Smith is already salivating. He looks forward to these cooking segments because it means he gets, <laughs> he gets a really healthy gourmet lunch. <laughs> Look at the what is this? This is so a this carrot. is shaved heirloom carrots. So you can take an actual. Come after on. After you peel the carrot, you can take the um, peeler and shave it right down. Oops, sorry, uh, camera. It <laughs> looks like a bacon strip, doesn't it? You can fool and trick your husband's ladies. Oh yeah. Mmm. <laughs> All right. Well, I, I always forget to do that because then I have to speak. Not supposed to speak with your mouth full. You can get some of the best produce yourselves without having to leave the city at Gray County. Make sure you check out Chef Paul Boomer Restaurant <laughs> on Ossington and Queen. It's the weekly farmer's market. You can sip a drink, shop for the farm fresh goods like these, and you support your local farmers all the while giving yourself nutritional value, which is the best way to eat, especially in the summer when it's there and available. Thank you so much, Chef. BreakfastTelevision.ca. Go see him this Saturday, 10 to 2, Ossington and Queen. And I will be there because it looks like a rather inviting kitchen as well. Yes, it is. When you do the work, too. Yes. Maybe I'll get it's some a of these. Wide open kitchen so you can see everything. Mm hmm. Yes.
How is that? Are people nosy? <laughs> Everybody comes up and says hello all the time. Do you regret having the open no, kitchen? No, I love okay. it. <laughs> Thanks, Jeff. Right now, over to Kevin Frank, to the newsroom.